uh, today's Wednesday, the 19th of September. Uh, it is the 125th anniversary of uh, Suffrage Day, and after question time today, uh, there will be a one-hour debate uh, led by the uh, Prime Minister uh, to commemorate uh, the passing uh, of universal suffrage le legislation in New Zealand. Um, questions today. Uh, first one is from Simon Bridges to the Prime Minister. Uh, does she stand by all her government statements and actions? Joe Luxton to the Minister of Housing and Urban Development. Uh, what reports has he seen on the housing market? Uh, Simon Bridges to the Prime Minister about communications between her, her staff, her ministers uh, around uh, the Derek Handley issue. Uh, Amy Adams, uh, a, question, a general question uh, on the economy. Um, Priyanka Radhakrishnan, the Minister of Social Development um, on the social security legislation rewrite uh, that passed through the House yesterday. Uh, Jamie Lee Ross on uh, Tauranga Roading, uh, Nikki Kay on Communities of Learning, uh, Mark Patterson to Police on where new police are going to go, uh, Michael Woodhouse uh, about uh, pay for women in the health sector, uh, Nick Smith uh, on the Clear Current Gmail issue, uh, Deborah Russell uh, to Ennis Galloway about pay equity, uh, and Andrew Bailey. Uh, on Kiwi Build. Uh, so after that suffrage debate, the general debate, which happens every Wednesday, will be delayed by an hour. We'll then go on to a local bill, the Tasman District Council, uh, Waimea Water Augmentation Scheme. That'll be the, the first reading in the name of Nick Smith. Uh, the Education, uh, National Education Learning Priorities Amendment Bill, uh, a member's bill, uh, second reading in the name of uh, Jan Tanetti. Uh, the Consumer's Right to Know, the Origin uh, of Food Bill. Uh, uh, second reading again in Gareth Hughes's name. Uh, the Land Transport Random Oral Fluid Testing uh, Amendment Bill. This is a, a bill to uh, attempt to have a more effective system uh, to identify uh, meth in drivers. And if we get on to it, the Protection for First Responders and Prison Officers Bill, the first reading in the name of uh, Derek Ball, but pretty unlikely that we'll get through to that.